Hi guys, YFSR3 will be better than DLSS3. Actually, to my mind, FSR 2.1 and DLSS 2.5 were pretty similar technologies in regards to FPS boost, but in many games DLSS 2.5 showed better picture without artifacts, and FSR 2.1 showed more unexpected behavior with artifacts. Of course, it was possible to say that DLSS 2.5 showed better picture than FSR 2.1, and now obviously DLSS 3 is showing much better picture than FSR 2.1, but we are still awaiting for FSR 3 and why actually I think that FSR 3 will be better technology than the LSS 3. And everything is pretty simple. AMD officially mentioned that their new upscale resolution technology will support all video cards including GeForce video cards. And the LSS 3 is an exclusive technology for only RTX 40 series video cards. And I think that everyone saw how good new DLSS 3 is boosting FPS in modern games. The LSS 3 can boost FPS up to 100, and of course FSR 3 will have to compete with these results. And just imagine that they will release FSR 3 for mostly all GPUs and that FSR 3 will boost FPS the same as DLSS 3 doing. So it would be a free technology unlike DLSS 3 that is an exclusive technology and that is available only for RTX 40 series, not even for RTX 30 or RTX 20 series. Of course DLSS 3 will show at some moments better graphic, not too much but there obviously will be lesser artifacts and other obstacles than with FSR 3. But in general, if AMD would decide to create their own FSR 3 exclusively for RDNA 3, it would be obviously not worse than DLSS 3. But AMD is doing really cool thing when they are creating new upscale resolution technology exactly for all GPUs. Because upscale resolution technology is the most useful exactly for all GPUs, as FSR 3 will give them really strong FPS boost which will allow them to play with all GPUs for a much longer time. So I am waiting for new FSR 3 to see how it will work, and if it will boost FPS the same as DLSS 3, it would be incredible. There is no exact date yet when new FSR 3 will be released, because now I am requiring some time to optimize it for all GPUs. Then thank you guys for watching this video, like and subscribe it if it was useful, and write below this video what do you think about new FSR 3. Thank you again and goodbye.